all of you have been finished the appetite and so tired, feel sleepy. All right. Now, marriage is a union of three people. Why some of you are saying, looking, three people? Why? It is the man and woman and God. That is the union of three people. So, as a parent, as parents, we are advising these children. And the children who are going to be married in future. When you think about marriage, that is a holy sacrament. That is a holy sacrament. You cannot play with that one. That is fire. So, submit, surrender yourself, everything to God. This is not the time to relax or enjoy. You have to enjoy as a human being, but pray, pray, pray very hard. Okay, now as I am assigned to read this marriage en engagement letter, so let me come to the matter. Glory to God. Mr. Gregory Uman, son of Mr. Idikala P. Uman, and Mrs. Eliam Uman of Upukeri House, Niranam, Kerala, India, currently residing at 11940 Avenue, Yonkers, Neon 10710, and a member of St. Gregorio's Malangari Orthodox Church, 50 Ludlow Street, Yonkers, Neon 10705, is engaged to be married to Miss Liz Matthew, daughter of Mr. Matthew P. Matthew and Mrs. Sally Matthew, Uttan Purikal House, Calicut, Kerala, India, currently residing at 1063 North 7th Street, New Hyde Park, New York, 11040, and a member of the St. John's Marthama Church, 9037 213th Street, Cunes Village, New York, 11428. By the grace of God, the wedding will take place at 1.30 p.m. on Saturday, October 27th, 2012, according to the faith and order of Malangara Orthodox Syrian Church, Yonkers, New York, January 14th, 2012. Now, as Linda mentioned something, I just want to make a correction. They are not originally from Patanadita. They are from Niranam, my own home village. Her grandfather, father's father, and my grandfather, they were from Niranam St. Mary's Orthodox Church. Where is Linda? Am I right? Yeah. All right. Now, there is something which happened behind before we arrived here. Please call the grandma in India. She is still alive and in good hands with her son and some other relatives. And she told the grandfather that she had found a boy from Niranam. Then what the grandmother said to her, you forgot? Emole, you went back where your grandfather came from, Nirana. She found a girl from Nirana. <laughs> a boy family is from Nirana. Went back to Nirana. Sorry, thank you. <laughs> so, God bless you. All of us pray for you. Even all the Achans and all those people gathered here on the well wishes praying for you people thank you now we are going to pray the engagement prayer please stand up from father big work is going to leave the glory be to the father son and the holy spirit amen, amen. gracious god once again 
we bow our heads before your throne of grace. Lord, you are the one who created all of us. And in your divine plan and purpose, you send each and every one of us to this world to be partners with you in your kingdom. Lord, in your time, you call each and every man and woman to be united to the holy matrimony. Lord, today, as we are here, we believe that you are calling to Gregory and Liz has been in your purpose and in your plan. And today as we decide on the wedding engagement of Gregory and Liz, we want to pray that your blessings be upon each and every one of us, especially to this, our children. Lord, as we take this decision, we believe that the decision is yours. And you are the one who is going to bless our decision. Lord, as we read through the Bible, that it's not good to be man alone in his life. And in your plan, you have constituted the holy matrimony. So as we heard this afternoon here, it's going to be a holy sacrament, a sacrament between you and a bride and a groom. That union will be yours. Through that union, your name will be glorified. Lord, we pray that the decision that we are taking today will be a blessing to both of them, to both the families, and each and every one of us who have gathered here and the community in which we live. Thank you, Jesus, for your presence with us this afternoon. Once again, praise and glory be to you. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. Now we are going to exchange the marriage code.